Hey guys, going on back again with another video, and this one, funny enough, is a COD Mobile uh, Zombies video or a COD Mobile video altogether, and it's about the second anniversary event that's going on. Uh, there's an Easter egg where you kind of go around the Battle Royale Blackout map and you look for uh, letters, or you can go into the multiplayer mode and collect some cake, turn in those cake slices uh, for some free letters. But it's probably better and easier to go in blackout because you get, uh, you potentially can get at least four letters um, per game, uh, depending how many locations you hit. So one of the letters that I opened today, and it's I believe letter number forty-one. If anybody is interested, it talks about there's an unsolved Easter egg in that was there was an unsolved Easter egg in the Undead Siege mode because. Um, as you guys know, the Undead Siege mode um, is pretty much um, gone until Season 9. I think they're reworking it. Uh, my assumption is they're going to make it a little bit easier because it's... Uh, I think it's perfectly fine the way it is. I mean, I'm just going to touch on that really quickly. Um, because it's a it's a mode that you have to work on. You improve. You, you kind of like an RPG game where... When you first spawn in, or even like Madden or, or Basketball 2K, when you start your career, you're at, you're ranked or rated at like level 60, and you have to work your way up to like level 100 or whatever um, ranking system they have. Under the Siege mode was the same thing, where your player starts out really weak, and you have to kind of grind, collect stuff, uh, earn points and whatever, and you, you use that to uh, improve your player. Uh, so a lot, a lot of people complained it was too difficult, but it's it's you should be in it for the long run. So anyways, besides all that, um, it says, does anybody play Undead Siege as much as I do? Just wondering, can you guys find the Easter eggs hidden in Undead Siege world? As far as I know, uh, I mean, I haven't Googled it. I haven't really uh, searched it, but I probably should have before I made this video, but... I was just so blown away that there were Easter eggs in there. Uh, I don't remember seeing anything. That's why I'm making this to see if anybody came across anything. Am I just stupid and out of the loop or kind of like late to the party? You know, no pun intended that like, um, did I miss that there were Easter eggs hidden inside the, uh, the map? Because, well, first of all, you don't have a lot of time to really salvage or look for stuff. Um, but as far as that, it was the original Battle Royale map that they used. I know there was Transit in there, uh, all pretty much, um, a lot of the locations. Uh, I think even the Lighthouse was there, but it, a lot of it is, um, you know, the Black Ops Zombies map that they used. Uh, Transit Bus Depot was there, uh, was one of the locations. I think the Lighthouse was one of the locations. Um, I don't remember seeing any Easter eggs hidden in the in the map. Uh, I know you you go to look and, and kill some of the bosses and stuff like that. And there's a giant crystal from the dark ether that you had to destroy. Uh, I don't know if that's what Anne. Um, I guess she obviously works for Call, Call of Duty COD Mobile. Is referencing maybe those like world events. I'll, I, I guess I'll call it like they do an outbreak. Um, but as far as that, the, if she or anybody from COD Mobile ends up watching this, the only thing I really knew or saw to figure it out, uh, which is pretty much explained anyway, so it's not really an Easter egg, is once you die or your operator dies, they get thrown into the, uh, undead siege mode, which is kind of like purgatory, because in the trailer you see the girl, I don't know her name, I'm still kind of new, uh, to the whole COD Mobile thing, but... The female player, who I guess represents us, ends up getting shot in the face and dies. And then Rick Toffin comes up and well, wants to cut a deal. I don't know if he's representing, like, you know, Mephistopheles or the devil or, or whatever. Um, or, like, pretty much, like, an undead world. Uh, or some type of, like, again, like, purgatory or something like that. Uh, those, like storyline narrative stuff i don't know if that's really necessarily an easter egg but that's the only thing that i really noticed or came across uh that you know the undead mode is supposed to represent like purgatory you're stuck in between i guess i don't know if it's i still don't even know 100 percent if you're stuck in between going heaven or hell or or stuck in between dying and coming back to life maybe a little bit of both um 
But I just thought it was really, really interesting that she ended up putting this in there. I don't know if maybe she wrote this um, prior to the mode coming out. Maybe they were going to put Easter eggs hidden all over the world. Uh, but as far as I know, there's nothing really that I came across. I know there's a mystery box. There's perk machines that were spread out throughout the map. Um, you look for the crates. Like I said, unless people... And if I end up finding anything, I'm going to end up linking it in the description just in case I am just, like, again, stupid and didn't realize that people solved this um, or came across stuff. I was just playing it. I just love playing it. I don't really uh, watch too many videos, um, but it actually is pretty cool. So hopefully if they do bring it back, um, unless maybe this is supposed to be for the new Undead Siege, they're putting Easter eggs in there coming up. That maybe the timing is off and maybe she almost kind of maybe um, let the cat out the bag. That they're putting Easter eggs all over the world. Maybe they thought it was going to come back in Season 8, but it's actually going to come back in Season 9. Uh, so maybe in a way she kind of <laughs> let the cat out the bag. Uh, so I don't know how um, or what this is supposed to mean if we missed stuff. I really don't think we missed anything. Maybe she's kind of jumping the gun, um, and they did like an oopsies and, and accidentally put this in there before the update version comes out. Uh, anyway, so if it is that case, then maybe people should keep in mind and start looking for Easter eggs, uh, which would be kind of cool. So I can't wait to see what they're going to do if that's the case, uh, if it's like scenario B where um, it's coming to COD mobile the easter eggs because i don't remember anything at all there's not one thing in the map that i can consider an easter egg and i played it a lot i beat it a bunch of times i beat all the five nights um or four nights or whatever five nights i think it was um i don't know if that's a thing maybe five nights of freddy maybe that was an easter egg i don't know um the machine the, the machine i don't know if the machine's supposed to symbolize something i don't know if she's meaning symbolically easter eggs or actual like easter eggs that you had to do or find uh there's nothing at all that comes to mind uh anyways if you know anything that i don't know or figure anything out or if i missed anything let me know i'll see you guys later